was the urban juggernaut Sean Black losing the title, but then putting his hands on our dear Showtime, Deshaun Watkins. Showtime has been in the hospital. He's been having issues uh, with some CTE, with some concussion protocols, but Showtime is here with us. Show, how you feeling, man? Come on in the building and talk to us. Show, you there? Yeah, I'm here, bro. Just, uh, uh, you know, laying down, uh, been throwing up. But we 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 gonna be good though. We we, we ain't gonna we ain't gonna uh, uh, fester in too much. You know, I'm kind of sensitive to light, yeah. so it's a little dark where I'm at right now. But it's still the mania. It's all good. I mean, it just you know, TMD Rock and Roll, TMD Moonshine, the Rock and Roll Audio Express, um, the 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 Ghetto Giant Grundy. Um, and of course, my main man, Shiloh Grease, the new undisputed Comptomania champion. Um, you know, I, I just feel like we're unstoppable. I, obviously, with me behind them, we can't lose. I mean, that, that's just how it is. What's going on, Mr. Martinez? How are you, sir? I how wish you? I could say I was a whole lot better. Oh, my God. You this know, such a shyster, man. I swear. This, this you is know, there's an old saying. That ignorance is bliss. And I can tell you right now, ignorance is complete misery. Five stacks, you hired me to be your lion in the courtroom. I got you positioned exactly where you want to be. It was, it, it was no mistake. It was no mistake that you ended up with the Rock and Rodeo Express and Shiloh Greaves. We planned everything to a T. And then what did you do? You sold me out for a few pieces of silver. You, you Judas. You, you're a Judas. No, wait, 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 wait. Let's back, let's back this train up a second. First of all, you couldn't find a good idea if it was crammed in your huggies. All right, you understand me? All right, listen, I came up with the section. I'm the one who brought together the talent. I'm the one who got the gold around the Rock and Rodeo Express's waist and my main man, Shiloh Grease. You've done nothing but cost me, Triple M. You cost me my champion in the beginning. He who has the gold makes all the rules. <sighs> fee fi fo fum. Look at this tiny short stack of a bum. You want to talk about holding the gold, but you threw away the golden vision, the one that had the Midas touch, the one that put you in the position to be where you are now. But when ill is gotten, easily goes. And you're going to find out who really makes the rules around here, Five Stacks. We'll see you in court, baby. He knocked him out. And his, his lights, the, the, he's been having issues, bro. He's been having concussions, bro. I mean, how, how can you punch your boy like that, man? I understand your frustration, but how you just going to lay him out like that? Well, sometimes in the hood, you know, you feel, we're all from the hood. None of us, we might not be gangsters or whatever, but sometimes it's just tough love. I don't hate Deshaun, but I do dislike the way Tom Domania, the root is gone. And so because what's going to happen now is, since I'm not going back to Inglewood with my chest pumped out, I'm bringing Inglewood to y'all. Matter of fact, mm. I'm bringing the world to y'all. So mm. I don't apologize for the punch. You in the business now, bro. You are not a civilian anymore. I mean, are you are you trying to end count the man? I'll help birth it. And I definitely take it out. Mm. Come on, Sean. I'm bringing, like I said, I'm bringing the world. So I had to make that call. And uh, made a little friendship. Anthony, I know you got some one of my friends waiting. Did, did you tell Deshaun? Nah, man. This is my worst nightmare. Ladies and gentlemen. What, what is Project, this? Project West show. What? Hey, so I'm going I'm to... I'm Y'all can hear me? Y'all can hear me right? Yeah, we can. Uh, I'm going I'm to I'm apologize to Sean for a second because I've been on this liquor for a bit. I did my business. You didn't even do that right. I hey, did it right, guys. so I didn't walk away. The oh, reason, no, no, shut up, Anthony. Ain't nobody listening to you. Shut up. I walked out and I took that win from Bovey and Sean. It was your fault that get that Manny lost that championship. That's why Manny don't like your ass. In the he told me not to mess with your ass in the first place. Get your hands down. 
You put your hands down. With the greatest. Do you understand? I could have took you to the heights. And now you could have took me to nowhere if you can't pay me. Where's my pockets at? You follow well, about, about, and, It ain't talk. about Compton. It ain't about verses. I'm telling y'all right now, it's about takeover because y'all can't do it right. Me and Sean been doing it for a minute. Show sitting there laid up because he got punched in the face. You know how many times I got punched in my face and I had to get up and walk? You sitting there laying down. That's a damn shame. You are a disappointment to wrestling in general. You gonna talk about Compton Mania? Ain't nothing, ain't nothing wild about Mania. Ain't nothing wild about Compton. Ain't nothing wild about Anthony Desiree. It definitely no right ain't nothing wild about Stax. I swear to God, next time I see you, if you don't have my money, I'm Yeah, that's if you get through Grundy okay. first. See to perfection. And make sure you watch close because you can you may never, ever see it again. And Sean and Wes, I want you to understand something. If you ain't Listen. Winning, you ain't winning. And this is the section. We belong. Compton does too. And you don't. <laughs> well, ladies and gentlemen. Big ass jersey out of here. So much going down. This is what it's all about. Where are you from? Compton versus the world. Amped up wrestling. Repping Inglewood versus pro wrestling. Repping Las Vegas, Compton Mania. Will Compton Mania survive? Y'all, y'all got to no. be March. To... Come on, Wes. Shut up. I, You're safe. I just want to tell you something, no. Mr. Wes. Say it loud. Say it loud. So, and you better say it with Produ respect, too. Producers, say it. I'm gonna t producers I want y'all to take everybody off. I remember back in August, you put your hands on me. And mm -hmm. You twisted my arm and you almost broke my arm. And me and Showtime have been going back and forth over this. And just hearing about show getting hit and hearing five stacks defending Comptomania, Wes, you what? put your hands on me again. And what? You put your hands on me again. And what? I'm going to snatch that damn beanie off your head. Listen, keep messing with me. I'm an announcer. I'm a professional. But I'm going to do be, my I'm, job. I'm going to be real honest with you, Anthony. I'm going to be real honest with you. I almost broke your arm. That means... I would have if I wanted to. I didn't. You're welcome. The reason I didn't is because I got what I wanted. Now, what happens if I don't get what I want next time, Anthony Desiree? Tell me what's going to happen to Showtime next time Sean doesn't get what he wants. I already know what's going to happen at where you're from. I already know. It's already planned out. We got it done. It is what it is. But what's going to happen afterwards is the problem. You sat there and you laughed when you talked about Triple M getting jacked up by whatever the hell was going on with five stacks. Y'all, you sat there and laughed at them. You think you're going to be laughing after I get done with you, Anthony? Compton Mania is on its last leg. And I tell you right now, it's not going to be a takeover. We ain't getting rid of Compton. We rebranded Compton. Once we get done with y'all, Amped up can do whatever it wants with it. And I swear to you, there ain't no Shiloh, ain't no Grundy, ain't no rock and rollers, ain't no five stacks is going to save you from that ass beating after I'm done with that.